All right, check this out. You guys are back on the episode of Blue Devil Reactions. And what we have going on today is a video titled Woman Thinks She Can Flash a Gun at People Without Consequences. Now, look, a lot of people that have weapons, a lot of people that have concealed and carry, they think that uh, law don't exist for them, right? Uh, we've seen uh, multiple videos, countless videos of pedestrians pulling out guns in the middle of the street flashing them shooting at uh other drivers for road rage we've seen people do countless things right well i guess today this woman gonna learn right she's gonna learn the hard way uh but before we get to this video today is the 29th of december 2023 the year is almost over uh two more nights and we are in 2024 new year new me nah we don't do that you know like i've said before uh whenever you're ready to change uh that day could be any day right but i will tell you guys we go live tonight 7 p.m on the hater world uncensored page and we go live again tomorrow saturday on the hater world uncensored page right uh we're going to do the music live request so these are going to be the last two music requests of the year Hopefully, they can turn out epic, right? Hopefully, a lot of people can pull up, and then we can have uh, a good time. We can play good music and not some same old garbage Chicano rap, uh, washed-up rappers, right? But only time will tell. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and watch this video. Women think she can flash gun at people without consequences. Now, look, one last thing. If you got Instagram, go over to Instagram. Go follow our media page, Hater World Media, and hit me directly at The Hater World. With that being said, let's watch this video and get you guys a Blue Devil reaction. Let's go. On October 2, 2021, officers responded to a call about a woman waving a gun in a parking lot. Yeah, she's in the store, but I didn't want to go in there without you. He got his gun out, too. So she hasn't left because the car still goes. Yeah. A lot of TVs. They're pretty expensive though. I went to Best Buy the other day and uh, I don't go and pay no 700 bucks for a TV. Well, You said red pants? Yeah. Yes. Hey, let's see if you can see anybody with red pants. Hey, anybody see anybody? Y'all see here, don't don't say anything. Just give us a call. Just tell us that where she's at. Don't make any contact work. She's armed. She's armed. How do you know she's armed? Hello. Oh, there she is right there, homie. Hi, how are you? Dandy. You don't, you don't happen to have a gun in your bag, do you? No, sir. Okay. You mind if I look real quick? In my pants? Mm hmm No. I said there's a black female with a red pant, red pants that had a gun. Not a gun. I just come in here. Okay, I understand that. What car do you drive? What car do you drive? What car do you drive? I drive a white BMW. White BMW. Okay. You keep eyes here. What's she wearing? What's she wearing? Okay. 1365 Oh, that's her. That's her playboy down to hey, a T. I need you to stand right here for right now. Something happened outside in the parking lot. In the parking You're lot. You're describing your clothing. Oh, no. You're to me. Who's already talking? Yeah. Talking to me. Hey, I understand that. Yeah, I need you to stand to right here. Just stand right here. She's wearing a tan hat and red shorts. Show me anybody else in this whole building that's wearing a tan hat and red shorts. I don't shorts. have on a tan hat. I have on a black and white hat. When people are in traumatic situations, they don't always describe it perfectly. Facts. Just me up, but I haven't done anything. I just came right. in That's why. That's why. You're all right. If you haven't done anything, it's very simple. It's just to comply. Let's get this over with. All right. I'm going to stand here. I'm a citizen. I haven't done anything. 
come on, let's get through this, right? But then again, you also have that feeling of I haven't done anything. Don't waste my time. Don't stop me. I got important things to do. I'm a civilian. I haven't broke the law. Leave me alone. So it goes both ways. It's really up to you where you want to take it, right? Let's go. You're not in handcuffs, but I don't, I don't know that you've done anything either. I just know that something just happened out there, and they said that the person walked into Best Buy. They described him as a black female mm -hmm. wearing a tan hat and red shorts. Yes, sir. You were the, you were the closest person to Best Buy, description. Yeah, that's and that's why I'm just saying, just for the time being, just stand right here. We're about to go back outside. I'm not going to use the bathroom by myself. Oh. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm a diabetic. I don't mean to frighten you, so I yeah, apologize. I'm a diabetic, so and I'm about to poop on myself. Okay, well, that, that's what I'm saying. I don't, I don't mean to startle you. Yeah, I just That's I why I wanted to explain what's going on. Basically, somebody just pointed a gun at somebody in the parking lot. The other person who got the gun pointed, she's standing up there. Okay. And she said, the, per the lady who pointed a gun at me is a black female wearing red shorts and a tan hat. She nervous. You could tell she nervous. Okay, so you just want to but walk you, up here to the front and I'll figure out if But you know what? Any type of police contact makes you nervous, even if you haven't done nothing. There's times where I get pulled over and I'm like, damn, I wonder what's going to happen. Like, I don't have nothing, but you just never know. Like, something might pop up. They might find some something, you know, they might bring something up. You never know. It's just all police contact is nerve-wracking that's why when you see the cops like why are you nervous why are you nervous motherfucker my life is in your hands right now right now you you, you can make up a a, sto a wicked story and i go to prison right now that's why i'm nervous if it was you yeah. if not i'll let yeah, you go let so. me use the restroom because i'm about to well i can't let you go in there oh, that's why i that's explained the situation so i just need to walk through the front if i can determine it's not you then just walk up here to the front. Oh, they gonna ID her at the front. They gonna ID her, homie. The rat is outside. Hey, where's the victim at? Uh, she's sitting right outside there for Okay. Yeah, for me, I was in well, we're gonna walk outside. She's gonna tell me if it's her. Question. Would you build a website for a major brand with more than 200 million? Question. Do you lie to everybody on your fake commercial? Let's go. We just walk right out the front door. Walk out the front door. Yes, ma'am. She wasn't really gonna buy that, bro. She just picked it up to look normal. Hey, have you seen a black female with a tan hat and red pants? Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, thanks for help, Jill. Wait, what the fuck? What the, what the fuck was that, bro? Was that a little kid, a little fat kid coming out the back? Hey, have you seen a black female with a tan hat and red pants? All right, thanks for help, Jill. Bro, what the f poor little kid? He walking out the back, and all of a sudden, he got a gun pointed to his head. And then the cop asking him, "Motherfucker, do your job. Don't ask me anything." The little kid scratching his head like. I'm trying to steal. I'm trying to steal a PS3 game, and this cop over here caught my ass. Let's watch that one more time, homie. Hey, have you seen a black female with a tan hat and red pants? All right, thanks for help, Jill. Hello, you see anybody inside? Ma'am, right over here. Right over here. I'm sorry, is her? Damn, look at all those cops. Well, you know what? She's in that little car. Yup, the gun is probably in the car. That's a lot of cops. I never had an encounter with anybody. Okay, so did you have did you have a weapon on you by any chance or anything? I don't have anything. Do you have a firearm in your purse? Do you mind if this officer looks inside your purse? I don't want to look in my purse, and there's okay. no reason to look in my purse. Well, you need a warrant, homie. I, 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 I get you. That's fine. That's fine. We're not yeah, arguing. Yeah, but y'all know my okay. rights. So okay. Well, not. at this point, you're in an investigatory hold right now. What's that? Right? It means you're basically being detained. So, you're not free to leave. And I'm, I'm taking, detained. I'm removing this purse from you. I'm, being I'm not detained. looking in it. Relax, relax. And relax, you're relax, being relax. investigated. I'm being detained. Just, just I'm like removing this purse from you. Just like you know your rights. We're giving you the right to tell you what we're doing. And I'm going to talk to you. 
I'm taking the. I'm removing the person. Come on, bro. Give this lady a a a Oscar. What do they call those? Uh uh. Give her a Grammy. I don't know what they're called, bro. And give her an award for best actress. Come on, stop this shit, man. Be a grown up. Yeah, I got a gun. Yeah, I did this. Well, you know what? Self -adm self admitting is something that I will say never to do. But she a civilian, right? And they got her cornered. They gonna search her bag. And those cops are going to be pissed off because you lied to them. You know. Let's go. We're not I'm just removing your purse. Do not, not reach in your purse. You just reached in, in your purse. I got the arm. No, don't reach in your purse. That's it. 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 So she pointed at you? I saw she pointed something at me. Okay. The lady, the lady with the gun, she called me a bitch. Okay. She me See, this is the problem now. This is why I, earlier I said, just tell them what you did. And I'm going to tell you why. She's going to break it down anyways, right? She's going to break it down either in the interrogation room, in the squad car, in the in the little security office. She's going to break it down. You're going to tell the cops everything that happened, right? If you're already going to tell on yourself, right, you might as well just from the gate be honest and say, yeah, I pulled out my heat because I was in fear for my life. I'm a civilian. I got a carrying conceal. I got a concealed carry license. And I really felt like this lady was putting my life in danger. So I pulled out my heat so she could leave me alone. But when you lie, you make up this these shenanigans. You act like you don't know what nobody's talking about. Now your story means nothing. Now when you actually tell your story, it just seems like you're telling it to get out of trouble. It doesn't mean like it doesn't sound like you're being honest anymore. So if you're a civilian and you're gonna snitch on yourself, you might as well just snitch from the beginning, bro. And don't waste nobody's time. But I didn't argue with her. I was driving on through. Where's your white BMW? Is it this third car on the right right here? I can't get that damn thing to let go. There we go. I agree. So listen, the best thing to do is just listen and follow instructions and then everything goes okay, right? Facts. Because if somebody claims something outrageous and they're the one who's causing the problem, we don't know that until we get here and find out, right? Yes, sir. So just let us find out and then we'll be good to go from there. I wasn't arguing with anybody. No, I'm not saying that you're arguing with us. We're just going to have a seat in his car until we get everything figured out, okay? You're not going to jail or anything right now until we figure out a little bit further, but you are being detained because you matched the description we were doing, okay? Very simple. Can you describe what the gun looked like? It was uh, about this big. Damn. That's, a, that's a heater, homie. Did it, like this? Did it look like a revolver or like a, a normal modern type pistol, like a semi-automatic type pistol? It was like a thick. Revolver. It was one of the thick ones. I'm not sure. <laughs> did it look like similar to what police carry? Or did it look like, yeah, it like a... smaller than that, yeah. So I'm going to take a peek here because this is a, allegedly hers, right? The one that they said was a red sign, or the one he was out with, right? A red vehicle of some sort. But she said white BMW. You see a white BMW anywhere? And y'all were walking across the street. We had already walked wow. across the street. Listen. We already had walked. Why homegirl got blonde hair, homie? Why homegirl got blonde hair? <laughs> do they not look in the mirror? Or do they not have friends? No disrespect to the lady, but come on, blonde a blonde wig. You know when you go to the store and you want you buy you you go to buy something and you're already going with the intentions of this is what I want, but they don't have it, so you gotta settle for something else. Like fuck, fuck it. I just guess I'll take this. I think that wig was that. I think she went to go buy something and. Didn't have the wig she wanted, so she was like, ah, fuck it, I'll settle for the Nicki Minaj look-alike wig. I guess she was thought y'all were in her way. It seemed like she didn't want to stop okay. while we were walking to get to the Chinese place. Yeah, right here. She stopped the car, and she stopped it, and said, did you call me a bitch? 
I said, yes, I did. And she said, well, you're the one that bitch in this now. I said, I'm a good one. And I walked, we walked on in. And the girl did like this. She was waving I it. I saw the waving gun. gun yeah. At any point, did she point it towards you? She, she waved it like. Like waved it towards. Yeah, like this. Towards Just it. letting us know that she had the gun. Yeah. So right now, you're going to be placed under arrest for obstruction. Okay. Yeah. That means you didn't follow lawful commands when we're telling you not to tense up, not to go in your purse, not to pull away. You lied about the vehicle you were in originally. You lied about being in an altercation with somebody outside originally. So we've got a bunch of false statements and obstruction. So 1407-110-15. Smyrna, where's the house Smyrna? Like I explained earlier, okay? Okay. So at this point when the cop tells you you're going to jail, you can't wiggle out of it, all right? So just shut the fuck up. You can't wiggle out of it, bro. Just shut the fuck up. Once he says you're going to jail for this, you can't wiggle out of it. Just shut the fuck up. And then when you were told not to reach in your purse, you immediately tried to reach in your purse. No, no, I was trying to drop. Look, I was trying to drop my keys and tell y'all that I had rights. I believe that. I in my purse to get anything. I believe that. I believe she was trying to put her shit away. I don't believe she was reaching for anything. I believe the lady, bro. And I bet you the cops do too, but they don't care, bro. It's up to the judge. They'll, the cops will hit you with a thousand charges. And it's up to you to prove it to the judge that those charges are bogus. It's fucked up what the cops do, homie. It really is. I was dropping the keys in there. I didn't do it. Before we keep I talking, let me explain it. these to you. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can. And you understand each of these rights as I've explained them to you. Somebody, I don't Not at this second. Know. Having these rights in mind, do you wish to talk to us now? I know you've already started explaining the situation, but... Yeah, I don't have, I don't have anything. Will you give me consent to search your car? Search the car? Uh-huh. Oh, that's his car. So? My son's car. What does that have to do with anything? This is his car. Okay. It's, it's up to you, yes or no? Okay. That okay? Well, well, we'll have to deal with that later, and in the meantime, if the business wants it towed from that spot because you're in a curbside pickup, then they can tow it. Come with me. We'll go back right to my car. Wow, what an hey, asshole. Um, He's going to get it towed. He stuff there so he can get it. What stuff? So he can get... Get what? Get my money and, and my sister. This is all going with you because it is your property, and I have to my search I have to search it before we go. My sister's property. Okay, we're not playing that game. Wait, wait. So he arrested her on the bogus charge of obstructing, right? You know why he arrested her? Now it makes sense. Because he arrested her, now he got legal right to search the property, the bag. If she, was, if she wasn't arrested, he could not search the bag. So he arrested her, not on what the lady said that she saw a gun like this, because as he say, she say, right? You can't really arrest somebody on someone's word, right? Without evidence, because the evidence is the gun. Where is the gun? You can't search my bag. It's illegal. So the cop found whatever bullshit charge oh, uh, obstructing because you lied to me. Is that possible? And now you're going to search the bag and the lady goes, you can't search it because that's not mine, it's my sister's. And the cop goes, we're not going to play that game. So the cop, come on, the lady lying. They're going to find the gun and now it's going to be all bad. So what are you doing? Right now you're going to sit in the back of my car so I can transport you when we're ready to do that. Why? Because you're going to jail because you're under arrest. And you know what the crazy thing is? that A charge like obstructing, they could release you, site release you. They could give you a ticket. It's not a major crime, bro. The cop wants to search the bag. What's going to happen is he's going to find the gun, and now she's going to go to jail for uh, uh, all kinds of crazy charges. Watch. So we very quickly tried to say that this is her sister's property and purse. Stop that receiver. She put two down the shelf. Oh, look. A Glock. Told you. Thank you, sir. 
Hope it's fake. Let's hope it's fake. Let's hope it's fake. Oh no, it's real. Nothing in the head at least. 1407 check a serial on a 69. Wow. Wow, that's an exact though knife. That would have sucked to get cut by. Actually probably would have been a lot nicer. Don't cry, Popo. Rusty dull blade. Hannah Montana. Well, there's keys to the scion. She has keys to the scion. It's her son's scion. Do you think he really likes Hannah Montana? Nobody asked you. Search the bag and shut your mouth. I think we're full of it. Okay. So, do we want to be truthful yet? What do you mean, do I want to be truthful? Well, the gun is in your purse. Uh, and Patricia's not your name. So, now you're getting false statement and aggravated assault charges. Aggravated assault on him. Yes, ma'am. The gun. And then there's... Pull your camera over there and see that I aggravated assault her. Okay. Uh, so... There's also, okay, also uh, identity theft and possibly illegal use of credit because this is not you. Okay. God bless it. Oh my God. Maria wow. Brown, Maria 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 Brown. She got good credit. Maria Brown, Maria Brown, Cracker Barrel. Wow, that lady got good credit, my boy. That lady had all the credit cards, bro. She had all of the credit cards. Now look, all this could have been avoided by her not towing the gun. I'm telling you guys, if somebody approaches you in public, let them talk. Who cares? If someone on the internet calls you names, who cares? They not going to do nothing. Nothing. They going to talk and talk and talk and talk some more. You know how you you know how you win all these weenies? You kill them with success, bro. You continue to work and act like you don't hear them. Eventually these weirdos will go away. They ain't gonna do shit anyways. This lady could have avoided all this. Now she probably got a post bail with all those credit cards and explain uh, herself to the judge. Now look, it said that she was charged with possession of a fire, a felon with a firearm. That means it wasn't stolen. At least it wasn't stolen. So check this out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Once again, meet me tonight at the live Hater World Uncensored, 7 p.m. Pull up, maybe 6 o'clock, maybe 6 Maybe six. Pull up, show some love. Let's get it cracking before the New Year's ends. I'm Blue Devil, and we out. <laughs>